Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Katie. I do different types of lifestyle videos and today I'm going to be doing a fun Target haul. You know that symbol. Check out how cute those boxes are. I've done a Walmart and an Amazon fall try on haul so I thought it was only necessary to do a Target one. I live in a very small town and the nearest Target is an hour and a half away. I know, sad tears. I was running to the city, so I picked up a few things in store, but the rest I just ordered online. I'll be sure to link everything for you in the description below. Okay, without further ado, let's jump into it. All right guys, I'm gonna be referencing my phone because my whole order is on here, so I wanna make sure I tell you the right sizes and the right prices, so if you see me look at my phone, that is why. Let's start off with fedoras. If you've been following along, you know that I love fedoras, and this one is especially cute. I will be adding it to my collection. This one was $16.99, and as you will see, I'm pretty much wearing this with all of my outfits, so this was a good find. The first clothing piece I picked up was this burnt orange cardigan. I've been seeing this color all over Instagram, specifically Liz Marie blog. She does farmhouse decor, very talented. And I really started following her as she talked about her infertility journey and her journey to adoption, which is near and dear to my heart. So yeah, love her, but she was wearing a cardigan this color and I just found it so adorable on her. I had to pick one up myself. This one is brand Universal Threads. I got it in a size small, it fits true to size. $29.99, I love the length of this cardigan. Super cozy, super warm, like you're wearing a blanket. Yeah, I really like this one. All right, the next item I picked up was also brand Universal Thread. This has like the bell sleeve, which I find super adorable. Look how thick that sleeve is. It's totally that 70s vintage vibe. I could picture myself wearing it like at a Thanksgiving dinner. I love the color combination. I got this in a size small, which I would say it fits true to size. It's the brown plaid. It's got a little button clasp on the back. I just think this is a really, really fun piece. All right, you guys know I'm all about that leopard. If you watch my Amazon or Walmart try on hauls, I'll link those for you in the description below. But both of those had leopard, and I think my most recent thrift haul had a leopard piece in it as well. So I'm loving leopard for this season, and this sweater right here is really, really adorable. It is brand A New Day. I got it in a size small. It is a shorter sweater, so if you're running something really long, I would not get this, but it looks super cute, tucked into jeans. I paid $19.99 for this. Yeah, the colors are really pretty. If you are a loving leopard, I would recommend this sweater. Starting to see a common theme with all the colors I picked up. Beige, tan, burnt oranges. This one is mixing it up a little bit. It's not burnt orange or tan, it is olive green, another color I'm loving for the fall. It's this plaid top. Universal Threads, it was $22.99. Now this is actually one that I picked up in store and I got it in an extra small. I did not try it on in the store, but when I held them up, the small looked a little bit looser and I was wanting a slimmer fit. And I was glad I picked up the extra small on this. I would say the small probably would have still fit me, it just would have been less fitted and that would have been okay, but if you want a slim fit, you might want to consider sizing down in this. You can pair this with like a denim or caramel jacket. It is a little bit longer, which I appreciate. I'm around 5'7", so I'm a little bit tall, um, but this was a perfect length for me. And they had this in several different shades as well. So if you're not needing an olive one, I would be sure to check out the other colors they have available. But this is a good option if you're in the market for a plaid top. The next item I picked up is this olive green wetter dress. Now this is brand A New Day. I got it in a size small and it was $29.99. I love the rib detail on it. I think there's a lot of versatility to this. So of course you could layer a jacket on top of it or you could pair it with like a belt. You could change up the shoes, which is what I did on the try on haul. And again, if you're a little bit taller, like I said, I'm 5'7". It is a good length and I would feel comfortable wearing it without anything else underneath it. I know they had this in several different colors. I was just really, really liking the olive color, and so that's why I picked up this one. I would say it's form-fitting, but not super tight, so still flattering. It's not gonna stick to every little thing on you that you don't want it to stick to, but it's also not one of those that's like super loose that it's unflattering. I think this is a cute option if you're in the market for a sweater dress. All right, and the last piece of clothing I picked up is actually the sweater I am wearing here. I love it so much. I did not want to take it off for this try-on haul, so it is like a looser, fit, see that? My arm is not that big, but it's like that oversized sweater look, but it's still long enough. I paid $24.99 for this. I got it in a size small, which is my normal size. 
It's just super comfortable. I know I have said this in multiple videos before, but it's like one of those tops where you feel like you're wearing pajama slash blanket all day long. And I really, really like it. I think it looks super cute tucked into some jeans. And of course you can pair it with fedoras. You can layer it with jackets. It's one of those pieces that because the color is so neutral, it can serve in a variety of different outfits. And I absolutely love that. Could not recommend this enough and out of all the clothing i will probably end up keeping this all right now we're going to switch gears and go on to shoes and throughout this video you've seen me pairing these shoes with all the outfits so yes all the shoes in this video are going to be linked in the description below these right here they make me crack up because my mom had a very similar pair when i was growing up we called them her clogs and we always made fun of them but now looking back i really need to go raid her closet because they were actually really cute and like they say trends always come back into style eventually and the 70s are back in style check these out i'm talking about the healed mule brand universal threads i paid 37.99 for these i think they are so cute and surprisingly, these are so comfortable. Usually with shoes like this, I don't find them all that comfortable. I just end up wearing them because I think they're cute. For some reason, my foot like molds into these shoes and I absolutely love them. Again, $37.99. I got them in a size eight, which is my normal size. So I would say they fit true to size. Love the pointed toe on them. So, 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 so cute. Sorry, mom, for making fun of you. All right, if you have not yet, please take a moment to hit that red subscribe button. I make a lot of videos like this, so if you are enjoying this video, I would love for you to follow along with me. And also, I would love it if you would add me on Instagram. Those are my people, and I usually do sneak peeks of my try-on hauls on Instagram before I have time to upload a video to YouTube. So if you are not following me on there, go ahead and do that. All right, the next pair of shoes I picked up are these square-toed mules. I got them in a black color. Brand is a new day. $24.99 and I am kind of appreciating the square toe. So I picked these up in a size 8 which again is true to size and I do like them. I'm not going to say that I love them just because not as comfortable as the brown mules. Like the brown mules my foot just really melded into them. I mean they're still somewhat soft but I'm not going to say like I'm in love with them. I don't know. They're cute and if you are in the market for black mules, I would definitely consider these for $24.99. The price point is pretty good. I just wonder how well they're going to hold up here in Missouri with all the elements. They do have these in leopards, so those could be really, really cute. All right, so the next item I picked up were these pair of riding boots. I will say, I thought they were going to be a little bit lighter than what they are. They're more of like a chocolatey brown color, where online they looked a little bit more of like the caramely brown color. But other than that, I do like them. I picked them up in a size 8, which is true to size. Let's see, they are $39.99. So at that price point, if you like the color, I feel like they're a good option. If you're wanting something a little bit lighter, I would look elsewhere. These would look really adorable paired with like a sweater dress and of course jeans and layered tops. Yeah, I don't have a whole lot more to say about these. Again, I wish they were a little bit lighter. I don't know if I'll end up keeping these. The last item I picked up was this belt. I think the official name for this color is like cognac but I don't know if I'm pronouncing that correctly, so I say caramel, caramel. I don't know, cognac is what is listed, so we're just gonna go with that. If I am butchering that name, I am sorry. You can let me know in the comments below. I'm sure somebody will. Anyway, this belt right here is a universal thread. It does have a floral pattern on it. I picked this up in a size small, and I will say, when I wore this with my high-waisted jeans, it fit perfectly. When I wore them with like mid-rise jeans, it was a little bit tight. Like I found myself trying to stretch to this last little notch here. So I usually wear like a size four to six in jeans. If I was reordering this, I'd probably size up to a medium. I don't want to just be like stretching to this last one when I could just size up to a medium. Okay, this belt was $16.99. I love the buckle on it. I thought it was really, really cute. And this went perfectly well with all the shoes that I got in like the caramel color. It really just helped tie the outfits together. So on the try on, you'll see that I have it on with this and with the burnt orange cardigan and even with the green sweater dress. So if you're needing a belt in this color, I really, really like this one. Again, $16.99. You might just want to consider sizing up. If you made it this far, thank you so much for watching. Let me know in the comments below what your favorite item was that I picked up. Oh, I'm still holding my water. If you have not yet, check out my Walmart and my Amazon try-on hauls because they've got a lot of similar stuff, um, similar price ranges, so check those out. And all right, I will see you guys in my next video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a great day.
Bye.